Link start, and hello everybody, welcome back to Sword Online Hollow Fragment. Uh, headed back in, uh, last episode was super dialogue heavy. <clears throat> My voice just wavered. Oh, I see not. Last episode was super dialogue heavy, this episode we're going to be getting some stuff done. We're going to keep leveling up Sinon as well. We got 85th floor stuff to do, including someone to help up there, which I may have tracked. I did. So that's where we're going now. I'll take Leafa and start with that. So transition to the 85th floor. Okay, welcome to the 85th floor in Nidorath. We gotta find a guy in the same place I gotta take Leafa to. This is the place. Shroud Forest Trail. A floor covered in trees. The fog is so thick, if we aren't careful we might lose our way. Yeah, let's keep a close watch. Alright, let's go find... Kazuto! Huh? What's wrong? It's the sun pendant. It just lit up all of a sudden. Is that light? Is it pointing north? Maybe it's trying to tell us to head that way. Yeah, I guess that's where the moon pendant must be. Seems like the sun pendant and moon pendant are calling out to each other. I guess this is proof of the power of love. I guess. Huey Lewis in the news. Anyway, let's head in the direction of the lights pointing. Sure thing. But first, let's help this guy. Are you... Hey, huh? Are you lot going to go farther ahead? Yes, we were planning on it. Is there something we should know about? Yeah, the place about it is called the Forest Maze. If you don't have a map, you won't be able to get very far. There's an event that will allow you to get a map, so if you want to go any further, you'll have to do that first. The event occurs in that forest over there. Alright, thanks. That helps a lot. Don't worry about it. We have to share what little bridge we have, am I right? Alright, thanks, Random. Let's help these guys. Didn't mean to break out the Eclipse. But we did anyway, so here we are. What do you need, Max? Alright, so it'll be a fighting one. Uh, so unless something interesting happens, we'll flash to the end of this help mission. Alright, let's go get that map. So is there a point around here where the map event will trigger? I guess just search till you find a situation. Oh yeah, speaking of, I can stop tracking you. Uh, give me a moment, I'll just double check that everything is in fact done. Alright, we're good. Couldn't risk that chest having the map in it. Whoa, calm down, camera. Alright, so we got we got orcs. This map is all about orcs. <laughs> Well, the left was a bust.
I guess where the person is standing was probably a good hint. <clears throat> Hello. Kazuto, look over there. Is that a boss monster? Let's head it back this way. What, really? It's too risky to just jump into a boss battle. Let's make sure we're prepared first. But what about the pendant? We can't let another player get to it first. If that happens, so be it. There's no way to risk our lives for this quest. But... I want to reunite the lovers. I know it's just some story an NPC told us, but here in SAO NPCs are people too. We can't just ignore her. Sure, but we can't afford to risk our life. Whoa, what's happening to the path? We've been surrounded by some kind of flame object. What a cruel trap. It looks like we have to beat the boss to get out of it. This is all my fault. There's no point worrying about that now. Oh, Kazuto. Look, we have to beat this boss to try to try. Are you ready? Yes, I've been waiting for a chance to show you what I can do. Good. Let's do it. I'm not too worried. Yeah, nah. As long as I don't get interrupted. Dang it! Interrupt me one more time. <laughs> Did we do it, Casito? Yeah, we beat it. Yay, we did it. We did it, Kazuto. Calm down, Sugu. Hey, look, the trap in the boss is changing shape. Map, I assume? Is this the moon pendant? Look at its design. It's perfect match for the sun pendant. Sure looks like it. They must have waited so long to be reunited. Still, I'm just glad they're not going to be separated forever. You really do have a good heart, don't you, Sugu? So the map was different than this. Different thing. Thanks, guys. So I know I kind of get obsessed about this thing. Yeah, now listen, Sugu. There's something I need to tell you. Things went okay this time, but next time might not be so easy, so don't be reckless, you got that? Yeah. You do understand that if you die in this world, it's all over. You're gone for good. I understand. So you can still do what you think is right, just as long as you're careful, okay? You mean you don't mind me getting obsessed and selfish about stuff? Of course not. Okay, I'll remember that. That's not to say I'll let you do whatever you want. Didn't you just say it was okay? Hey, don't start twisting my words, Sugu. Hee hee hee, I wouldn't dream of it. Okay, let's get moving. We need to take the pendants back to that NPC. You're right, I mean, nothing happened when we put the pendants together. Hi, right, let's go. What's wrong? Let's hurry up and get moving. Kazuto, I am... I know the truth. The truth about you and me. What we really are to each other. Wait, is that an enemy? Guess it was nothing. Sorry, what were you saying? I missed that last part. Oh, nothing. Okay, let's head back to that NPC. Something rustled. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, here you go. One sun pendant, one moon pendant. Ah, I always knew this day would come. I always knew they'd be reunited. Thank you ever so much. Now, if you'd be so good as to make me a fairy circle. A fairy circle? Go back to where you found the sun pendant and make a ring out of flowers. A boy and a girl must put on these pendants and dance around that ring. Fairy dance. Only then will the two separated lovers be reunited forever. So we need to make a ring of flowers, right? And then you and me need to wear the pendants and dance around that ring, Kazuto. You and me? Well, who else is there? No one, I guess, but I don't think I can dance. I've never been into rhythm games. Don't worry, I'll lead. Just follow me. You'll be fine. Uh, isn't this quest just the best? Much better than fighting monsters. Uh, let's just get this over with. We can't really give up now anyway. That's right, Kazuto. We're so close to reuniting the lovers. Woohoo. Alright, where did I get the sun pendant? 83rd floor, one more time. So this isn't the full exploration of the 85th, after all. <laughs> I missed which one we were supposed to go to. Fungus Forest, okay, so it's not one we could have just warped to. Here we go. 
This looks like the place. All right, let's make a ring of flowers. Okay. There, all done. That was hard work, but I think the worst is yet to come. Are ready to dance with me, Kazuto? I guess there's no point putting it off. Let's get started. First, we need to put the pendants on. This is kind of embarrassing, isn't it? It's making me blush. Last time I danced was back in elementary school at that camp we went to. I've never seen you like this before, Kazuto. You're usually so confident. The only thing I've caught about now is stepping on your toes. Don't say that. This is just like a sword skill, except without a weapon. That's easy for you to say. Just need to breathe together and go with the flow of the music. <laughs> Ow. Sorry, I stepped on your foot. It's fine, don't worry. Now just follow the rhythm. Like this. That's right, one, two, one, two. What was that? Huh? Our footprints, they're glowing. The moon pendant's glowing too. Oh, there's someone standing in the shadows over there. Oh. Sun Sovereign, sweetheart, finally we meet again. The moon Monarch, my dear brother. Is that the fortune teller? Was he the owner of the moon pendant all along? Thank you both for reuniting me with my true love. I thought I would never be held by my brother again. I cannot thank you enough. Now we'll be together forever. Our bond as brother and sister will never ever be broken. Oh, my dear brother. They've gone. They left the penance behind, though. I guess it's okay for us to take these? I think they probably want us to keep them. Right, you better take the moon pendant then, Sugu. Say those two. They were brother and sister, right? That's right. Didn't you notice that straight away? So you got so obsessed with them, Sugu? The fortune teller talked about them loving each other and stuff. I thought they must be a couple. Is it strange for brothers and sisters to love each other? Uh... Haven't you ever thought that it could be possible? Well, it's just... What if they weren't really brother and sister? Not really, I mean. Because I know something important that you don't. I know the truth. The truth about us, that we're not really siblings. So you knew. Yeah, mom and dad told me a little while after all this started. They explained that your mother is actually mom's little sister. Sugu. Hearing that made me really confused. I said some pretty mean things to mom. My head was a mess, but the thing that freaked me out the most was you, Kazuto. Me. You've known all along that I'm not your real sister, right? So what was I to you? That was the question I kept asking myself. I didn't know who I was, I felt like I was living a lie. It wasn't like that. I wanted to believe that, I really did. I wanted to talk to you about it, but you were here in SAO. And since you didn't come back, I had no choice but to come after you. I had to find out what kind of a relationship we really have, Kazuto. I've already found out a lot in these last two years, and I realized something. That even if you're, we're not real siblings, you're still my brother. Of course I am. You'll always be my sister, Sugu. I know. That's not all I realized, though. I realized that I'd always known the truth. I just kept it hidden away. But the truth is I'm glad we're not real siblings. I mean, now we can be both things. Siblings, but also something else. Something more. Huh? Kazuto. Sugu. I feel just the same way as the Moon Monarch. Even if we're separated, I'll always come after you. To SAO or to anywhere. So let's stick together. Sugu! How do I get out of here? This way. That's probably enough for a video. Just want to say hi again. That's probably enough for a video in there, I would think. Uh, so thank you really so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, leave a like, comment, and subscribe. I'm going to record the next one right now, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.